Hey everybody, this is Tony with your quick five minute demo on Be Instantly Better Now Pain Release with Release Workouts. What we're going to do is the standing twist. You can do it seated, right now we're going to do it standing. So you're going to get yourself a kind of an athletic like position, balanced off, feet are flat on the floor, knees are slightly bent, body is nice and tall. Now this is what it looks like. You're going to twist over here and you're going to twist over to this side. That's basically what it is. Now we're going to do it in a way that I'm going to describe it to you. So I'm going to face this direction, and I'm going to twist all the way over to the right. Being twisted all the way over to the right, right here, I'm at my end range of movement, as far as I can possibly go. So on the left side, I'll do the same thing. I'm going to twist as far over to the left side as I can possibly go with that shoulder end range. Now, you'll never move into pain. So one side painful, one side not, you're only going to be working the good side. If both sides are painful, don't do this exercise at all. There's a list of other ones down below. Just follow how I'm teaching you how to do it. So one side's going to feel better than the other side. If you have a hard time determining which side feels better, answer this question. Which side would you rather go to for the next two hours only that way? We'll call that your good side. Now, we never work out the bad side, we only work out the good side. If both sides hurt, skip this exercise and go to the one below. So I'm going to assume that your right side is your good side. So if I turned all the way to the right, to the end range over here, as far as I can go, I'm going to take a nice deep breath, and I'm going to do six of those breaths out here. Real deep, and exhale, and then come on back, to the front, standing straight and still. I'm going to do that side twice. Then I'm going to come back and I'm going to test the other side and see if it has gotten better. I'll bet that it has. Or feels better. Or a better range of movement. Or it's smoother. Whichever it is, I want you to do this exercise again. Let's say the right side is the good side. We're going to stay over here and go to that end range, and we're going to take another six to ten deep breaths, and make sure that I'm really pushing out to that end range. That's what we're after. What you're going to notice is the previously what we called the bad side is going to get better and better and better. Now, one more thing I want you to do before you do this exercise is standing where you are right now, decide on a scale of zero to hundred how uncomfortable you feel right now, or how, dis how much discomfort or pain you feel right now. Zero being no pain at all, 100 being the worst you've ever felt in your life. You're going to find yourself somewhere on that scale. And as you do this exercise, you're going to notice that you're getting better and better and better and better as you go along. And then if you add in all the exercises down below, you're going to get even better. So that's our five minute demonstration. We really want you to try it right now. For those of you that are in your do-it-yourself, you're ready to go. For those of you that want more explanation of why this works or how we make it into a workout so that it resolves your pain issues for the rest of your life and you can teach this to your family, your children, your friends, your coworkers, and have a skill to make you better, health, more healthy, healthy bleh, than you ever have been in your life, then you need to call us or email us. Our number's below and our email's below and we'll get you in for a discovery session so we can resolve your issue from this point forward. Thanks for watching. Do the exercise now.